But as we get into Thursday afternoon, that's when our chance of strong or severe storms will fire up. Uh, the entire region in this slight risk category from the Soarin's Prediction Center and even an enhanced risk uh, over into parts of eastern Mercer, Lawrence, and extreme southeastern Columbiana County. Uh, so here's the situation. As we get into tomorrow afternoon, that cold front will be moving on through. The showers and storms will be trying to fire up right over top of us and then just get stronger as they push southward. The risk is going to be there. Uh, high winds. The tornado threat is there tomorrow afternoon and into tomorrow evening. It's on the lower end, but it is there. Something we'll be watching closely. Uh, yes, large hail and, of course, brief heavy rainfall. You get temperatures like we're dealing with now and a, a lot of juice in the atmosphere. These can be uh, very heavy rain producing type storms uh, across the region. So here's how it plays out the rest of this evening into tonight. Again, uh, mostly clear skies, hot and humid. Uh, the risk of an isolated shower a storm popping up overnight into tomorrow morning, not zero, but very low, and that risk will stick around early tomorrow morning, but a very warm and humid start to your Thursday. Heat index readings by midday uh, getting close to 100 degrees again uh, before that cold front moves through. So we'll pick it up at noon here, and then the cold front will be knocking on the door into the afternoon. This is what I expect. I expect a line of showers and thunderstorms to develop. And again, these could form right over top of us, which would probably be our best case scenario if they just continue to get stronger as they move out. Uh, but it does look like into the afternoon, uh, the chance of showers and storms will just continue to increase from the northwest to the southeast. Any of these storms that can get going can become stronger, severe, and then as we get into tomorrow evening, they will continue to gel into a line and push off to our southeast, at clearing the area by early tomorrow night. And then we're into some nice weather. Now, lower humidity building in, cooler temperatures settling in as well. That goes for your Friday with all kinds of sunshine and lower humidity expected. A very pleasant Friday evening here across the region as temperatures fall back out of the 70s and uh, we'll just keep falling into the weekend. 73 tonight, warm and humid. The risk of an isolated shower extremely small tonight into tomorrow morning. A better chance of showers and thunderstorms firing up across our region uh, tomorrow afternoon, getting stronger as they move through and push south of the area. Area late in the afternoon, high temperature at 90, the wind picking up. That'll make it feel a little bit better through the day. Uh, there's your weekend forecast. Not a bad one. 79 on Friday, mostly sunny again Saturday. A high struggling to get to 70. Low 70s on Sunday. Early next week on Monday and Tuesday, just a small chance that a shower pops up into the afternoon. Very small chance, but the temperatures right back up around 90 next Tuesday and Wednesday.